Here we go and welcome to the idea of technology. My name is Michael and today I just thought I will do a really quick and tiny review about the Hyperjuice charger I have here in my hands. It's the world's first and most compact 100 watt charger with two USB type C's, two USB type A ports and up to 100 watts. So this sounds pretty interesting. So let's get into it right after the intro. But first now let's get started why this is so special and why just doing a review about it. Um, the most interesting part is, um, as you probably know in the title, it's a GAN charger. That means um, GAN stands for gallium nitride and this is a completely new way of building chargers um, like this one here from Hyperjuice. It's now made of gallium nitride inside as a semiconductor mm. despite the fact that most normal um, chargers you can find at the moment out there are just normally made with silicon and with gallium nitride now we have half the size compared to a silicon charger it's way more, way more efficient it's it keeps cooler and at the same time you have more flexibility that means we have what you get smaller charges in the future with way more power and way more efficient outlets and 100 watts in this size is just really impressive that means you really can charge your 16 inch macbook pro with this at full speed without any hesitation and the charger is just way smaller than your normal MacBook Pro charger you would normally get with your Apple product. And on the other side it runs more efficient and way more cooler so this is also just a big bonus and you're not only getting one USB type C port you're getting two and also just two USB type A's. Just to mention and um, when we talk about the type C's they each for themselves can put out 100 watts power delivery 3.0 but on the other side the USB type A's can deliver quick charge 3.0 as well with 18 watts but you just need to keep in mind it's not something that you have some Huawei, Oppo or Samsung or some other um, charging protocols you're some com you are so completely sticking with quick charge 3.0 and power delivery 3.0 so there's no other opportunity to quick charge your mobile phone but when you look on the notebook tablet side you can go up to 100 watts and if you're just sticking two three or four devices into this little charger the complete overall output will be just limited to 100 watts that means when you just have two MacBook Pros and you're just doing some light work and um, you can basically charge with this one charger two MacBook Pros at the same time and completely utilize this tiny charger and Hyperjuice just keeps up with their promise that this is just the size of a credit card which is just pretty pretty impressive. If you're not already known Hyperjuice they already have funded uh, battery packs on crowdfunding uh, platforms like Kickstarter and Indiegogo so you definitely need to check them out with a link down in the video description because they're just super awesome and I really love the idea what they're doing and they're really pushing the technology we currently have and at the moment just every normal notebook or tablet is just chipping with silicon charges and I think gallium nitride will be the future of charging. On the other side there's a little downside of this product that was often mentioned on the crowdfunding campaign side and um, just because it's only a wall charger that means you really need to use this foldable prongs to put it directly into your wall and there's no different solution for it if it's something like you want to have some outlets on your table and that are horizontal it's no pr big problem but if you're looking at vertical outlets like you have at the wall and um, especially when you just use the internal prongs that are made for the US um, you could basically have a bad time because um, as I already noticed when I was in the United States um, the outlets can get really loose and probably this wall charger can fall out out of your wall if you have really loose uh, wall and power outlets in the US but on the other side you can also just um, use the three different uh, prongs that are also delivered with this product and you can just put it an, on the foldable prongs in the US version and then you can just use it in UK, uh, Europe or whatever you want to go. If we look at the current state of all the crowdfunding campaigns all around gallium nitride charges, 
it get, gets really messed up. If you look at Kickstarter or Indiegogo, there are so many different chargers already crowdfunding and funding really, really successful. But I would admit that Hyperjuice was just the very first one with this small footprint as well as 100 watts and pretty decent IO on this side. So um, you can really say this is the very first 100 watt charger within this size and with this power. So this is just really, really impressive. Why I also covered this product is really easy and it's now just commercially completely available. So you just don't need to fund it on Indiegogo or Kickstarter. You can really just go to Amazon or just to the Hyperjuice store and just get it from there. It costs $99, which is in my opinion, just a really good price compared to the competitors out there. And you get just everything you need to get for a couple of years to come to charge all your devices, whether it's just USB type A or just USB type C. At the end, this product definitely keeps up with what was promised in the crowdfunding campaign. And I was also pretty happy with the shipping. So you definitely notice that Hyperjuice with their Hypershop and all the different products they're already funded and have on their side. I definitely know what they are doing. They have the experience and they have all the necessary certifications and all the knowledge they need to deliver really good products out there. And I'm just really happy with it. So at the end, I can replace all my other chargers out there. I can only just keep this one Hyperjuice charger with me. In addition to this, I also have a big battery that I can charge with it. And then I now can run all my products I have in my pocket and in my bag all the day just keep it running with the one single uh, wall charger from Hyperjuice, which I'm just super, super happy about it. So if you want to check it out, look at the links down in the video description and buy it for yourself. You won't be disappointed. And if you dislike this video, you know what to do. But if you liked it, hit like down there, get subscribed and enable the notifications with the bell icon so you won't miss any future video of the idea of technology. And I just want to say thank you very much for watching. Have a great day. Bye.